thanks to the sharp eyes of Kirkland police officers. Good afternoon and thanks for joining us for Fox 13 News at 5. I'm Matthew Smith. Now, I'm Hannah Kim. It started out as a call about a theft at a gas station, but quickly became something very different. Fox 13's Alejandro Guzman joining us live from the nearby motel where the girl was found. Ali, so what are you learning? Yeah, this is that exact motel where that missing teen was found this past Saturday, thanks to those officers. When we arrived earlier today, police was on scene, but they wouldn't comment on exactly why they were here today. As you guys mentioned, this all started when at a gas station, when a theft was reported in Totem Lake. The officers say, well, they were out on the call. They spotted a car at the Motel 6 that matched up with the case out of California. The department says the FBI had alerted them about a missing teen believed to be at the Motel 6 in the area who was a victim of sex trafficking. Officers say they went over to check it out and saw several items they say led them to think the car was connected to the case, so they kept digging. Their findings leading them to a room where they found the 16-year-old girl. We spoke with the FBI who says teamwork is what helped get that team to safety. Uh, this is one of those great examples of, of teamwork and partnering with our local agencies. This is something the FBI was working very hard on over the weekend, trying to locate this girl, and it just worked out. It worked out great that she was recovered safely. Officers have since impounded the car and arrested two men who were booked for multiple crimes, including promoting commercial sex, sexual abuse of a minor, and Child Protective Services is now caring for the teen. Tonight, police want to remind everyone that if you believe that an adult or a child is being human trafficked, to call the national hotline. That number is 1-888-373-7833. Of course, we'll keep you posted and have the very latest as we continue to monitor this ongoing situation. For now, I'm live in Kirkland, Alejandro Guzman.